Hello everybody, how are you all doing? Today is day what feels like 200 of quarantine. Um, I have been doing lots of homeschooling. Um, I've been doing lots of Animal Crossing when I'm not homeschooling or not taking care of my one year old, who you hear right now because she's playing. Um, Animal Crossing until like three o'clock in the morning. So I barely get any sleep, but that's okay because that's how I'm surviving this. Uh, also, Tiger King, can we talk about this? Um, I know a lot of people have watched it. A lot of people don't want to watch it because it does look silly and I have to agree. It looked really silly and I didn't want to watch it for the longest time. But when I actually sat down and watched it, I was like, Cause I saw Tiger the hell did I just watch? Like literally what is going on here? Um, I have so many questions, so many questions. First of all, I think that they should definitely reinvestigate the, uh, Carol Baskin's husband going missing. Carol Baskin. Carol Baskin. I consider that bitch to be one of the biggest terrorists in the exotic animal world. Carol Baskin. Carol Baskin. Carol Baskin. Carol Baskin. Carol Baskin. That could be a whole entire show all in itself. Plus, I love that kind of stuff anyways. But what? Like, I just can't. I just can't. If you guys watch the show, you need to leave comments down below and let me know what you think of this whole ordeal. I mean, I don't want to ruin it for anybody who hasn't seen it and wants to, but I just had to talk about that. Um, but anyways, um, I thought that I would... I definitely need to get some new hair clips, huh? It's orange things just just aren't doing it for me but that's what I got so what am I gonna do um I thought that I would use the jawbreaker palette today because it's spring and I wanted to do something light and pastel and colorful this is also quite simple it's not like a cut crease or anything like that it's I think I probably used three or four shadows in my whole entire look so um Without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so I did the rest of my face off camera per usual. I'm taking a little flat eyeshadow brush. You can use whatever you have. I just think that it packs on these colors on the lid a little bit better for me. Um, so I'm going in with the Jawbreaker palette and I'm going to be mixing the colors F-U-C-K. Yes, that is the name of the shade and the shade Bubblegum together. And I'm going to be placing that all over my lid. And I'm also bringing that up a little tiny bit into my crease as well. Don't be afraid to keep dipping into that those two shades together and making them more vibrant um, because sometimes they do go on a tiny bit sheer. Not so much the Jawbreaker palette, but I've noticed with other pastels, they go on a little sheer and you kind of got to build them up a little bit to get the pigment you want out of them so don't be afraid to keep going back in once you have that as pigmented as you want it i'm just taking a morphe m433 brush there's no product on this um, actually this step isn't very necessary, but I just went in and blended everything out. I ended up taking those same exact two colors and just adding more to my crease. So that step really didn't matter if I did it or not, since I'm going back in with the exact same two colors. If I was to go in with a different color, that step would have been helpful, but I wasn't really sure where I wanted to go with this. So you guys can just skip that part. Um just adding more of the to my crease and blending it out now i'm taking a js9 i believe that is it's just a small blender brush and uh there's no product on there at all and i'm taking that and i'm swiping back and forth over the top of everything i just did to try to blend it all out because i'm going to be adding a orange shade which is called suck over top of that I do love these palette shade names. <laughs> 
Jeffree Star is so funny. I just love him. So on camera, this doesn't really read like it's a different color. Um, in person, you could tell that it was a different color. I'm just taking that and lightly brushing over everything. Even when there's nothing left on the brush, I keep going over everything and making sure everything's blended out. Now I'm taking a cream shadow brush. I just like it because it's flat and I'm taking the white matte shade. It's called Virgin and I've really, really, I don't know why lately, I've just been loving using a plain matte white for my brow bone. I don't know why. Instead of shimmer, matte white. So I, I took some of that and then I felt like I lost that color a little bit, um, the orange. So I just kind of went back in there and placed the orange back in then I went back in with that same matte white and I popped that into my inner corner as well fairly positive I was dancing to Mickey Mouse I just felt like you guys needed to be aware of that <laughs> so now I am mixing the shade Brain Freeze and Cute together. The cute is kind of like a minty green and um, Brain Freeze is very blue. So I'm mixing those two together and I'm placing that on my lower lash line. I was trying to get myself better in the camera because I noticed whenever I do my under eyes, I'm looking down into the mirror and it shows that I'm not, you can't really see what I'm doing. So... <laughs> hard now I'm gonna take a blue NYX eyeliner I'm not really sure what the name of that one is I'm gonna go back and look and I'll leave it down in the comments for you guys but it's a shimmery aqua blue and I'm just going to place that in my waterline after that I decided I was just gonna take my fluffy brush and I just wanted to kind of blend it outwards to make it sort of like a wing shape on the outer edge and that is it guys um i did everything else off camera obviously the only thing i added to my eyes was a wing and i popped a little bit of orange in my inner corner and that was with jeffree star's jawbreaker palette i absolutely love this palette if you love pastels this palette is for you as always don't forget to subscribe to my channel click the bell so you don't miss any of my videos and i'll see you on the next one you don't have to excuse the replies there. I am going blind looking at Carol's ugly ass. Okay, Carol, Carol.